I'm dreaming off the road again Set free in the wind Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video is going to be my son's and I's nighttime routine. So if you want, just keep on watching. So first off, I just want to say I'm so glad that you decided to stop by. Um, now, this is like nothing too special. This is just something that I do with myself and with my eight month old. But the first thing that I typically do is I go ahead and prepare the bath water. Um, I kind of do a little bit warmer than most people do only because it's going to sit there for just a little bit and um, he plays in it. Um, so then I also get the stuff that he needs for his bath. I'll get his pajamas, um, anything, diapers, anything that I'm going to need afterwards. All right, go ahead and lay it out. So another thing that I find that works best for myself is I go ahead and prepare a bottle for after his bath time. Um, there's been many times to where he's been super tired and starts getting fussy towards the ending of his bath and while we're getting dressed and it just helps my stress stay down so I go ahead and make the bottle that he's going to need. Sometimes I range from three to four ounces. We've been doing four ounces lately but this is what works best for the both of us. So once the bottle is ready to go, I then take him, start getting him ready for his bath, take his clothes off, and I add it to the pile of laundry that I also need to do, so don't mind that. And then I also just let him sit in the water for a little bit, let him play around, splish splash, enjoy it. I found that this kind of just helps brighten his mood. You know, he really enjoys it, so why not? We also did this a lot when he had RSV, and it helped tremendously. So if you aren't already doing this and you have some extra time during your nighttime routine, please try it out. But this is a soap that we use. It's Baby Dove for, like, sensitive skin care. We were trying Aveeno, and it was breaking him out. He has sensitive skin, kind of like how I do. So this is what we switched to. Um, now, before I start washing him off, I typically, you know, run some water over his head, I wipe his face off with nothing on the rag, just water, and then I will start the bathing process. Now, once done, I also just clean his earwax out with a towel. It's quick and easy. I also make sure I have some teeters on hand so it keeps him distracted while I'm drying him off. And then I let him kind of play around, and then I give him his bottle, and then we lay down and just kind of cuddle whatever and eventually he will go to sleep and it's lights out for the little buddy so after this i will collect all the bottles that are dirty and i will start washing them that way they're already done and then i will get the stuff that i need for my shower if i'm taking a shower this night now for in this instance i am going to be brushing my hair because it gets tangly so quick so I just go ahead and brush it before my shower because there's so much fallout no matter what. And I found that it kind of helps to where there's less in the shower than not brushing it. So once I have everything situated, then it's my turn to get in the shower. Now I don't use anything fancy. These are the two Dove body washes that I'm going between. Now this red one right here is the one I use once in a while it actually reminds me of once I was taking my showers after I had Carter um, and after the shower then I just kind of do the rest of the hygiene you know clean my ears floss brush mouthwash all of that fun stuff I'm done with all of that I then start filling up the water humidifier if I don't want to use the water one that will use our waterless one they're both fixed brand highly recommend they've been doing so much help these this past month 
Um, once I'm done with that, then I will actually start prepping the bottles again. I tend to use three to four of these. I fill a couple of them up that I know how much I will need throughout the night. It helps when I'm half asleep. Um, so if you haven't tried this trick out, go ahead and try it out because it is a lifesaver. I then do a few more extra stuff, kind of like taking a drink of water, applying some chapstick. It helps because my lips have been getting chapped where my nose has been congested and I've been mouth breathing, so that also helps. And then I will get his formula, his bottles, diapers, maybe a little extra outfit or whatnot, and I'll put it in this bassinet that we don't even really use. It's just kind of like my nice stand, if that makes sense. And then I turn the lights off. Sometimes we watch this campfire and then we go to bed. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below and check the description down below. Bye guys.